All right, you guys, here we are at Xenoblade 3, which I will, I am currently and will always be still figuring out, but we're also still actively enjoying. Look, remember I was questioning what's the difference between a yellow one and a green one? That's a standard quest, this is a hero quest, which means it's probably based on a hero that we can have with us. So we're gonna continue this one, AKA press the Y button to activate it. I'm using an Xbox controller, so that's the X button. But if I don't look at the controller, it makes sense. If I look at it, I get very confused. Controller dissonance. Okay, we gotta go this way. Which I don't trust us going to the colony. They are going to kill us. Now, that's unfortunate. That doesn't look like good news. All right. I do miss the Camilles though. I missed y'all. The calm ones just don't compare to the Glaw. You know, the Glaw. The Gluck Gluck 3000. Fully. You tell that to Xenoblade Chronicles 2. Lots of terrible things happened with Ether. But sure, Noah. That's offensive to people that died in Xenoblade Chronicles. Xenoblade Chronicles 2 killed so many people, especially in fucking Torna. The bitches were dying. There was this girl, I don't remember her name, but I, I thought she looked like Sabrina from Pokemon. She was part of the, uh... Malos' team. She died. She just died. Except for, I think that was Xenoblade 2. I don't think it was Torna where she died. I don't know, but she died. And she had a boyfriend named, like, Mikhail. I guess what? He died too. The girls are dying. But this isn't about Xenoblade Chronicles 2. This is about Xenoblade Chronicles 3. Oh, yeah, night happens. What's fighting? What's fighting that stays fighting, yeah? I hear Star Wars noises. I'm hearing Star Wars noises. Oh. I mean... I could help people fight. Y'all can fight. Y'all can fight your own bunnies. Your own bunnets, I should I should say. How's the supervising going, Mr. Commander, sir? Five by five. Five by five. Thank you. Now zip your mouth and let's Hey guys, why aren't you all killing me? Hey guys, look, it's me, the defector. Look, I am the one that made it so you can't eat. Why am I mocking them? I love them. They're my own people. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just want to understand. Now I'm going to follow this red line. Though I could explore the colony, but we're quite the small colony, really. Especially compared to some of the others. What's the commander thinking, letting in Agnians? Oh, so it's already been approved of. I guess we have the commander with us. That's why we're not being killed. You guys are pretty. You guys are eerily similar. Okay, well, before the Shining happens, let's get up here. I've never seen the Shining. I don't know what happens. What's, what's the one with the twins in the hotel room? Isn't that the Shining? What's the movie with the twins in the hotel with the carpet? Y'all are gonna have to let me know. I've never seen any movie ever. Because no good movie has ever been made ever, so... Hot take. But not a new one, I've said it. There he is! That's Taxi or whatever his name is. With the, he has a shit name, but he's a good guy. I'm impressed. You didn't run away this time. You wanna get hit, you look like a baby. With your big stupid forehead, your big dumb eyes, and what are these 2001 Chola? Ooh, Chola might not be a good word. I'm very sorry. I, now I must justify my potential crime. I went to high school in uh, Yuma, Arizona for most of it. I guess for all of it, but I didn't finish high school at you. And um, that's why I'm stupid. I didn't finish college. I dropped out of high school and dropped out of college. It was truly a double homicide. And uh, the girls were like very certain ones proudly chola but just like black people can call themselves the word all they want does it, can i say it but they didn't mind being called cholas like we would call them cholas like they were my friends cholas loved i don't know what it was gay people and cholas is like a match made in heaven but now i keep saying chola what if i'm not allowed to say chola know that i have good intent know that i'm open to growing and know that i will avoid using it further because potentially bad but i don't think it's that bad but I'm, if somebody tells me it is, I will listen. I'm impressed. You didn't run away this time. I'll kill you. I'll explain what kite, is. not taxi. The rest of you are dismissed. Looking fine, though. Stay cool, Kite. Rold, you big and buff, but you're not as I'm hot as you could cool. be. Kite, you seem unwell. Tell us about Agnes's movements. Right now, they're assembling their forces on Everblight Plain. They've stopped concealing themselves, which feels like cause for concern enough. That is kind of scary. They're confident they have the numbers for a full assault, then. Or perhaps it's a feint. 
or they're just a bunch of dolts who like pretending they have a plan. <laughs> okay, don't count on that, Kite. I'm not in the mood for jokes right now. Hey, we need a little levity sometimes. <gasps> I said levity in one of these videos. I was digging for a word and I used the word levity. I feel like that's a pretty niche word. So, Kite, maybe we're on the same page. The red hair, the deep red hair, you'll never see me with deep red hair, but it's so pretty. With enough food, we can draw this out. Give the word and we can even launch a raid. I told you, that's not going to happen. It would cost us too many lives. What then? Our troops are hungry, anxious, and quite frankly, more pissed off by the hour. Would you rather them dead? You leave things like this, and we're going to fall apart by ourselves. Also, if there's this much discontent between the troops, like this man, and the leader, the commander, that's very not good, and if he'll speak up like this against the commander, it shows that it's been bubbling there for a while, or that he has no self-control, but I'll just assume it's been bubbling for a while, and that makes me very worried about Colony 9. We could just remove their reason for fighting you. Flame clock. What? I am Noah, which is me, so I, we, me and Noah, are obsessed with this like breaking flame clocks. Every time we meet somebody, we're like, hey, you want us to break that flame clock? And they're all like, what? <laughs> sure, what? And I'm just like, yeah, I could break that flame clock. I got a sword. Like, what's up with me like loving to do that? If we smashed your flame clock, it would alter the equation. If you smashed it, uh, they would have nothing what? to gain from it. Well, now I know you're all jokers. He he, ha ha. Do you want to live? Kite, biggest joker of all. Oh, Riku. This way, kite always runner up in life. No one can take serious with hopeless oh. and best attitude. Oh my God, Riku! Don't eat the girls like that. Don't read them like that. Oh my, Riku. Take off your wig, you're acting wrong. Riku doesn't act right when he's got his wig on. Shut it, Riku. You, you really know how to hit oh. him when he's down, don't you? Responding with vulnerability and admitting that he's down instead of like just with heat and like fighting back with like aggression makes you feel for him. Why are you back here anyhow? How'd you worm your way back into Zeon's favor? Blame it on the wig. <laughs> no worming performed. <laughs> we don't need you here. I've had enough of seeing my friends die. Betray me. I can't deal with this dirt anymore. I'm not happy that we've hurt him and the whole colony, but it's like a personal hurt to him. We feel just the same, which is why we want to do as much as we possibly can to help. That's why we came back. Hey, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Let me tell you something about Marfi. Marfi's my friend Harry. Where does Marfi come from? I don't know. But he will play Super Smash Bros. for like six minutes and then be done. And then like an hour later, he'll pop back online for six minutes. And then like he plays it a hundred times a day, but for such short bursts. And I'm happy that people are enjoying the Switch as a handheld console you can pick up and put down. But oh my god, Harry, calm down. Yeah, you're not fooling anybody. You need not believe them. But they will prove to be an asset. Huh. So if you'll allow us to be. You're siding with them in the end. You're not, we're not siding with each other, we're aligning with each other right now. And maybe that seems like a technicality, but like, there's a difference. You choose Noah over your own lieutenant. Again. Oh, he's a lieutenant, that's why he's got some nerve about him, okay. That's not what I'm saying. Don't you realize how hard I'm trying here? This man is hurt. <gasps> This. Why do I feel like I could cry? <laughs> Kai is very hurt. And it's not like... Because I know he's opposing us, and I think maybe they want me to be like, Oh, Kai, what a hater. I really... F we hurt Kai. The situation has hurt Kai. Kai's at his fucking limit, and he doesn't feel like anybody's fucking listening to him. Kai, I love you. You're wrong, but I'll listen to you later, okay? Go sit in your room, and I'll come Sorry. by and talk to you and calm you down. I didn't mean to complicate matters. On the contrary, was this not your intent? I would have thought you'd be gloating by now. Well, then you don't know me very well, do you? We can gloat if it makes you feel better. Me, <laughs> Noah. But you can't just judge someone in the heat of the moment. Whatever you might think, suspicion will be cast upon you. I welcome it. That is all I can say. Suspicious or not, isn't it about time you tell us this plan of yours? You said we'd prove to be an asset. I'll continue. 
Though we have a geographical advantage, our provisions and numbers are limited. That's what the enemy will be banking. But also, morale seems to be limited as well. And that's where you come in, as the vanguard. Our Hard five vanguard. Will put a spanner in their works, and that will give you the edge you need, right? But we don't want you winning against them. Why do we act like we want this t the Colony 9 to win against this Agnian troops? We don't. We want the fight to not happen. If the fight is going to happen, we shouldn't be rooting for either side. Am I wrong? Seeing Keves and Agnes Bods fighting together and tearing up their front line is going to throw them off their game for sure. Hmm. So we've got to fight independently. It's... <sighs> huh. Better than being on a leash, I suppose. You seem to misunderstand. I'm not cutting you loose. You are still being regarded as traitors. Keep in mind that I shall be supervising your every action personally. I hate you. You know what? I'm starting to like him more than now that he's being serious. And out in the overworld, he just seemed like a teenage baby piss. You know? Now, he, now he's a bit of, more of a man, but I still don't love him. But I understand you're supervising me. That's perfect, perfectly fine. Sir, yes, sir. Commander, sir. <laughs> Lex is such a dick. <laughs> Let it go, guys. I'll send details of the operation to your iris. The plan will commence at once. We're on it. Lance has such balls on him, and I really appreciate it. Also, do what do y'all think Lance's balls look like? And I won't go too much on this because I'm sure nobody loves when I'm like overly horny, because it's like not appropriate and probably not okay. But I bet they're they're fun. What does that mean? I don't know. I just hope they're swinging, you know. But also. I don't know, he's been living at war, he should be tense, those things should be inside of him. If human evolution has done anything to our bodies, his nuts should be deeply inside of him and protected. But I hope they're swinging and hanging, you know? Alright, let's head out where we're going. I hate that I have to have this dude in my party, where is he? <laughs> I'm seven. Like, I want my, my little boy, what's his name? I want my little dude on our team. Valdi. Is that a dove? What is that? That's beautiful. Level 1 beauty? Light fly. Oh, we've seen them. I just don't think I've seen them at night. Wow. The luminescence. The bioluminescence. Truly something, yeah? Oh, bunnets. You evil little freaks. I don't think they want to fight me now that I'm higher level than them, yeah. I expect great things from you. Special forces lads. I appreciate him giving the designation of former because I don't want to be aligned with them. I don't want to be uh, associated directly with them. We are two separate teams working together. We are not one team right now. Do you know what I'm saying? Does that make sense? Am I being pedantic? Well, oh, the music in this game. Listen to this music. Listen to that music. You're tuned into Z... Enoblade.5.3. Oh, that would have been so much better. Point three. Z Enoblade.3, where we've got piano, we've got strings, and we probably got a whole orchestra on retainer should we need one. Uni? You okay? Just feeling wistful. Wistful? What a word. This is where we went looking for fortune clovers, isn't it? <sighs> oh yeah! I need some of those you actually, really so if I could grab some while I'm here. Did not. Just wanted to wish upon one. <laughs> All the others laughed in my face. Said I'd never find one here. Did you? Everyone but you guys and Zeon. Hmm. Oh, now Zeon's a close friend. You're not the kind of guy who makes fun of people when they're trying their hardest. You help people in need. Listen, I know you've been through all sorts of crap, but you don't know the whole story. Y'all gonna make me cr Ooh. Oh, I'm sure. There is no such thing as a traitor who rebels without cause. You know what? I'm sorry for calling you a piss baby. 
you've got more perspective and brain in there than you were showing. And I, sh I should have known that. I know you better than that. My bad. Be it Kevis, Blackness. You've sent many of my comrades off. No. Time and time again, you saved the dead, helped survivors, even me. I know you do not make light of people's lives. Not the slightest. So you understand? I do. But I can never be the friend to you that I once was. And why? You don't give a set tree, do you? I wasn't talking to you, Lance. <laughs> These two, one, need to fight. Two, need to fuck. Three, need to just accept their differences. Because after those two things, they're still going to hate each other. Excuse me? Maybe we can't go back to the old days. But we can build something new. Boom, that's the end of the game. Xenoblade's all about building something new. Has that not been the point in every game? I feel like it has been. Whatever. Leave your platitudes for after. Platitudes. The battlefield awaits. I'm so used to playing very simple, like, games that platitudes, I'm like, damn, they got some smart people in the room. I'm like, no. They just have a couple grown adults make working on this game. But I'm just so used to, like, Kirby being like, oh, the whoopee doop cake pie. And I'm like, ooh, platitudes. I don't know. Shin Megami Tensei basically had peen in it, so. Don't worry. We'll win. No one's dying on our watch. Never again. Hopefully. Time to move. Stay sharp. Where the heart is. If you know where the heart is, find out where the groove is. Hello, bunnets. Little bunnets. Little baby bunnets that don't want to fight me because they're babies and I'm a full grown Noah man. If you find anything out of the ordinary, I'll issue the order. I appreciate it, right. thank you. Also, let me not just, like, brush off the severity of... What? Of the conversation we just had. It's very nice to know that he does understand us. He's not... Because he's been very much rude and opposing. But he does understand that we're not just here purely to oppose. And it was nice to see that. To see that bit of understanding and perspective. Perspective has been the word of this series so far. Electrician. We can use the terrain for defensive advantage. First, we need to hurt them. I'm around. scared this is gonna be hard. Before that, we need we to have to like roast them. I'll remain here and fight for as long as I stand. That's also part of the plan. There will be a grueling fight. I won't have time to be looking out for possible deserters. Hmm. Hold on. Are you telling us to find a chance to escape? I never said that. But this battle should be of little importance to you. Spark's sake, Zeon. Just how rotten do you think we are? I see where you're coming from. I don't know if I do. But we're fighting on our own terms. We'll be seeing you Okay. Soon. We owe a debt to Colony 9. Maybe it wasn't for very long, but it gave us somewhere to belong. But not anymore. Just shut it, you. How hard is it for you to accept someone just wants to do a good deed? Hey? Get a clue! Lance! He is so headstrong. How often is the word. does he need telling not to abandon himself to his feelings? Well, how often do you try to strip people of their feelings? How often do you try to invalidate people's reactions and expressions because of the fact that they do have some tinge of emotion in them? If anything, reactions, emotions, expressions should all have a tinge of emotion in it. It doesn't negate any like point or argument. If anything, it fortifies it because we're humans feeling. That's a big part of the things we do and the ways we act. Leave it alone, you fucking piss baby. I'm sorry for calling you a piss baby. We're friends. We just had a very nice moment. But I don't like your fucking attitude. <laughs> huh. Still. 
Well oh, he's got a shield. I feel like people never have shields. I don't have a shield. We better not lose. There are four of them, at the very least. I need to get behind him. Okay, he's just like, quit launching him around, because I need to get behind him and it fucks me up. <laughs> It is crazy that we are seven people currently on this battlefield. Again, if you play Xenoblade 3 on your Switch, please stop and ask your Switch, how are you doing? Seven people? Too much. Because it's not just running the models, it's running the AI for these people. As well as the enemies. So that's seven plus four, which is, in my mind, eleven. Are my numbers correct? I hope so, or else how embarrassing. I'm not doing much, sorry. I have to like realize what I'm focused on, then I have to like get behind them. My directional stuff is really something to work with. But watch this. Woo! Oh, I need to change my class. We'll do that next time I get to access my menus. I truly need to change everybody's classes. Yes, it'll make us weaker, which is why it's scary. It's like, well, I'm always doing story stuff, so I'm always getting stronger and stronger battles. So, like, to weaken my team by lowering our classes and stuff is, like, a little spooky. I should probably just save it for when I'm grinding, but I won't be doing that right now. And it feels like a waste of time if I don't... Oh, God! Who am I fighting? You. That was... I did a back spike from the side, and I felt bad about it. Do you see what I mean with it gets very crowded on screen and I can I can get confused about what I'm doing and where and to whom? Chain attack, don't mind if I do. You'll know I love a chain attack. This mechanic really got me. The inner league's cute and fun. It looks really cool, but this one is very satisfying to actually play gameplay-wise. Now, let's go Nora. I miss, I miss, uh, Valdi, but... Tif 15 TP, wow, I really couldn't read that. Upon own reactivation. I just, I could have broke with Noah and then toppled with this. I didn't realize this man had a topple. Huh. I'll just do it anyways. Now... Finish off with one of these. Damage up to 50. Hey. Okay, chain attacks feel very silly. Yeah, we're definitely overkill. And then I'll leave the chain. Yeah, because what are we doing, you know, at this point? It's not always time to be a complete baller. Sometimes you just leave the chain attack and. Who am I fighting? Him. I was supposed to hit him from the side, hit him from the back. I got very confused. Do you like how I've stopped making jokes by hitting from the back? Because I say it and do it so often that like it would become so tired. I named the first video hitting it from the back and I'll let that speak for itself. How many are there? There are still two left. Was there, were, the, were there five of them to start with? I didn't know a battle could have more than four enemies. We're thriving. This battle's like really not kicking our butts, which is... Nice to see. I hope we got toppled. I'd be breaking people all the- Oh no, he's zooming up and- Look at him, spinning. Oh, he got launched. I don't know if that's our first on-camera launch, but that's what a launch looks like. The girl starts spinning. Oh my god, they're endless. Endless troops, really. Oh, there's six now. Yeah, there are six right now. Holy shit, y'all. That's too many. We're gonna die. Okay, why are we missing this man consistently? I should do one of these. I should. I can do another chain attack. Should I do it, you guys? Should I do it? Let's do it. Right as they're doing it, they're interlinked, sorry. Uh, let's do him, just for the gag. Deflector form. And then I'll do... 
You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do Noah. I'm gonna do my side break. And then, guess what we're gonna do? We're gonna topple. Just because I want to know how that goes. We did a topple! Now, does anybody have a daze we can use? Well, it doesn't matter. Now, did I get extra TP, tactical points, for doing that? Oh, I didn't get anybody back that turn. That kind of sucks. No, I got Noah back. Okay, never mind. I lied. Sorry. Now, Noah. Nobody else has a... He has a topple. I mean, we don't need to be doing the most. We really don't. He's almost dead. But, like, I want to topple him just for fun. It's kind of really satisfying for... Damn, 91 points. It's kind of just, like, really fun for me. No, it's not. Okay, overkill. Once we see that, we gotta we gotta stop. But uh, Noah's back in action. Do I get something out of like doing just supreme overkill? Is there anything I get out of this other than wasted time? Because I want to keep doing it. Don't get me wrong. There are still five of them left. Who am I after this guy? Also, fighting troops feel sick. I know that we're not going to kill them because that's like how we fight, but it feels like we're killing them. Okay, y'all are launching the bad guys all around, and it's like really fucking up my aiming my attacks. He dropped his helmet. Okay. Who am I going after? This pack is a lot of people, and we're like not dying. We're truly thriving. Did they make this easy on purpose, or... Or is there a lot more to come? No, that was it. Well, goddamn. What the spark of Ouroboros doing here? I did not sign up for this. Their eyes are beautiful, like golden color. It's like honey. We aren't here to kill each other. Pull back now. Zeon. Zeon gets it. I'll bet you won't. It's your only fucking chance, so take it, dude. Because you'll be dead. Oh, okay. You're just bold. You're just very headstrong. Lednesses. Foolish, really. Always keep your ace in reserve. That's how the game's played. You need to keep that voice in reserve. Uh, I'm being hateful. I don't have a great voice either. I'm sorry. Don't falter. I like we it though. The but I know it's not like a soothing, handsome voice. So, I get it. Yeah. And we'll hold the line here. Whatever it takes. Round two. Which the first round had many rounds of its own, so. Oh shit, that was shit. Where is he? I need to get behind you, sir, so please quit getting launched if you would. I know it's a struggle for you. His shoes seem to have no grip on the ground. What do we call that traction? He's just slipping all over the place. Somebody got toppled. Good on them. Somebody's asleep? We're not being very nice. I've got four enemies we're going after right now. Ooh, sorry, hit you right in the face. That's kind of rude. Okay, so he's done the skirmisher. All the way over here. Oh, somebody's dying. Maybe we should get on that. Where is he? God. It could be a little more clear. Sorry to complain. Oh, should I do my interlink? Yeah, that sounds like fun. Okay, this battle seems a bit harder. We need to... Yeah, we need to... Where's my dude? There he is. Also, he toppled my fucking friend's interlink. It's kind of fucked up. Get out of there. Who am I after? Who am I after? Who am I? Who am I after? Oh, this guy. Oh my god. 
That's not behind him, but whatever. See, the bigger the machine, I've said this previously, the harder the directional attacks are to like figure out where I am on on the guy. Okay, he's a kill. Yeah, he's shooting lasers all over. We need to not be so rude. Chain attack. I love a chain attack. Okay, so we're gonna go. Sure. I don't really understand ether defense, so I'll prioritize taking down their physical defense. Let's topple it. Let's topple it. Homeboy's been broken. Now I should use a healer in the middle, and actually I will. Oh, but that one has a daze. I'm, it's not good for my chain attacks to do it in the order I'm doing it right now. But I just want to do a full break topple daze. You know? I've never done it through a chain attack. She has a daze, where'd it go? Well, I'll just use his. She used to have myopic screen, oh, but then I switched them. I forgot, okay. Does anybody have whatever comes after days? Like a launch? Um, I know we have a launch, I don't know why it's not. Whatever, you haters. This one's like zooming, so let's let's do that one. And by zooming, I mean it's like sparking. <clears throat> okay, we did something with that. I'm gonna have to fight that other robot back there, and I know it. Furanus. Don't we call the beast the mechanical beast Furanuses? It seems like anything that's mech, mech, I guess, has been called a Furanus in this game because there was little Furanus. It's not just like these big, great titan-sized ones, which I guess they're not titan-sized. That would be nuts. That would be the end for us, really, if they were. Not the most skillful chain attack, but I did a full. Topple days, break topple days. The old BTD. So I'm pretty happy with myself. Oh god, he's back. Go for it, bud. It's not 99 points, but, you know. It's not bad either. There's about to be more, and I know it. <coughs> I'm done. You don't have to be. Stop fighting. Squad leader's been hit. Pull back. Why aren't you following them? Because we've told you. I told you. I don't want needless slaughter. You're soft, rookie commander. Better soft than dead. Let me better soft tell you than. Something. Contributing to like needless murder, and I know needless is eh, because you know it keeps his people safe. It keeps, but in the grand scheme of things, if you can zoom out that much, which is hard to do, and even if you can do it, it's hard to maintain that perspective because you do have individual needs that need to be met. If you can zoom out, look at the big picture. Being soft is a good thing. You don't win wars while keeping your hands clean. You're gonna learn that the hard way. I don't want war. You'll see. I will die preventing war before. Oh no! I guess we will. Don't let it get to you. Oh, it's getting to me. I wouldn't normally, but in this instance, I'm afraid he struck a chord. Oh, he's sensitive. I believe I said something similar to you in the past. We were. Sparring with training swords. Oh, he's that shit little boy. I, I thought maybe he was, because, like, Taxi. What is his name? What is Taxi's name? God damn, it's like Neddy or something, but Taxi was with him. So you were that shit little boy. Let me just say, 
You've grown into a less shit grown man. I think you're pretty cool. We don't agree on everything, but you're, you're a good guy. In the end? I did. Because you always held back. That's not true. <laughs> you hated the very idea of fighting. That's how it seemed to me. And back then, I thought you'd never survive with that lofty ideal. I was blind. You were young. If we don't stand for something greater, strife and conflict will grow. That's what years. we're saying here. Exactly. And if I die failing in an attempt to ease conflict for the future, that's fine. Because I planted my seeds in your mom. No, I planted my <laughs> seeds of perspective. And my perspective is the word, man. But my seeds of peace. And I will just trust that they'll grow no matter how many generations it takes. But for our own bloodlust. Exactly. That is who we are. It was never going to be easy. Yeah. I'm still trying to figure out what's right myself. But there's something I want to change. And to do that, I have to change myself. No, a hippie. And so am I, so you know what? Kite and the others pull through, okay? Kite. It seems we've averted disaster. For now. For now's the best we can do. We can't avert it forever. Still unfinished business. Zion, I want you to understand the things we've seen. The truth about the flame clocks. Yeah, we're kind of woke, actually. I forgot that other people don't know that, like, there's a freedom. Just let us explain. After that, we'll let you have the final say. As you wish. It also saves us an awkward silence on the way back. But don't get your hopes up. I think after war and fighting, silence isn't the the worst thing. I think it'd be very nice and healthy to have. It's fine. But Thank we you. must talk because I must pitch him on letting me break that flame clock because it is my fate. I get so horny to break these flame clocks. You know what? Why is my phone going off? You leave me alone. Jesus. I'll round up everyone in the square. But first, to call any nine. Gotta go all the way back. Y'all can probably warp there, huh? We'll end this video just like we ended the last one with me doing a quick, a fast travel. Or did I start this one with a fast travel? I don't know. Where am I going though? We're going here. You're kidding me. Y'all want me to walk like a plebeian? Oh man. You still want me to walk upright as well? Homo ass shit right here. Oh, is that the sapien part? Which part of homo sapien is the upright part? Probably sapien, because homo means like homogenous, like one, unified, yeah? Hmm. Sexually upright. Gay, gaily upright. What is a sapien? What's a homo? I'm so mad that I have to walk all the way here. I lied to y'all, we're not fast traveling. Daddy said no. The map said no. My mom said I, I can't fast travel right now, but I, I can run over there and it, it won't take too long. Little bunnet. Wood bunnet. How many different breeds of bunnet are there? Little bunnet. So far I can name two. But I'm sure we've seen more than that. Does this game have like a encyclopedia of like the life and like vegetables and like all the things you grab and see? That'd be kind of fun. Like Pikmin. Do they really grow from head? <laughs> being watched. He must be very wary of me. Oh, those. See, like little like flavor lines like that where it just like builds on a character and the dynamic between characters in such a small seemingly insignificant way i think they really add up and make this game as significant as it is funny enough i haven't saved in a while we should probably eat something it's good to keep a record okay i'll go to the canteen and buy some food later but I don't need... no 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 not yet oh i should be following the red line long white line 
Where's the way? Y'all want me to go what? Backwards. That's the way to where I'm trying to go? Are you sure? That's the way to where I want to go? I'm not going to question you, but what? I swear, if that fish tries to fight me... Piran hacks. Look at the, look at the little flop, floppy ear frogs up there. Flops. Flog, flogs. Flogging is something some people do sexually. And that's okay. Is that just like being hit by like a... I guess not a whip, because that's whipping. But isn't flogging like you're getting hit by something? Let me know down below what flogging is. It sounds like something to do with like water. It sounds like waterboarding, but I know it's not. Oh, look at that rainbow. There we go. <gasps> the green one. Wow. Taxi. Oh, shit. I mean, how are we going to break a flame clock without killing a console? If we've learned anything at this point, kill a console, break a flame clock. Except for, I don't think the consoles die. I don't know. When I defeat them, are they dead? Good work, Theon. Why does every console seem like a miserable, Just watching from the shitty man? And I must say, it was quite a spectacle. What letter is this one? Huh? In what way? Bed pod. I forget. You drones have no aesthetic sense. Mm-hmm. Your drill skirmish was one thing. It almost put me to sleep. But this here. Well, I'd say the colony is due a promotion. Oh, for bringing us back? Troll skirmish. The one where these maggots surfaced. Loads of little worms plotting together with Agnes, then deserting their duty like the cowards they are. Truly what are you disgusting. talking about? A disgrace to the colony. And that goes for the ones who croaked for nothing, too. Even calling that troll is a disservice to the word. Croaked for nothing? I know you see us as enemies, but this, it's our friends you're talking about. Yeah. Even Wamba. Back then, how dare you! Silence, maggot! Or what? You must still be tired from fighting. Let's find out. Them. You will give me great pleasure as I crush you. The pleasure is ours. Whose shield was that? Oh, it's our dude. Zeon. Now Zeon's rebelling against a console. They don't know how to feel. What do you think you're doing? The words of an idle man who orders others around. <laughs> the words of who risk their lives for us. Which do you think is worth more? Silence! Ooh. This is insubordination. And what of it? What the fuck? He's being weird. He launched himself up in the air. Not gonna lie, that was pretty cool. That rock thing was pretty cool. This man is nimble. He must be console in for nimble. Oh my god. Ooh. He's a loser, but he's not as much of a loser as I thought he was. Do you think we'll get to just kill him in a cutscene, or do you think I'm gonna actually have to do a fight? I feel like we're gonna probably have to actually do a fight. <gasps> Am I about to break the clock? I'm already at the clock. Save me the fight, bud. The maggot that feasts on our dead. That would be you. Ooh, ooh, I'm so happy. That's my own colony too. It's level three. What of it? It's there's a special, special sense. Madness. You seek death, then, Zion. We want to live. That is why we satisfaction, fight. special sense of satisfaction. Now whose side is the colony on? 
Okay, they're, they're up against him too. Good. That makes me very proud. Prepare yourself. Console B <gasps> for bitch. No, bitch is too obvious. Console B for for big stupid. What does B stand for? We'll find out. Oh, we're gonna have to do this battle. Console B for. It's a secret. We'll figure it out during the battle. Man, what if I lose this battle? We're gonna do this battle in the next video. We don't have time to do this battle right now. And hopefully I win next time. Now is everybody else fighting? From no. Oh, I can't pause. No, I can do. I can do this. All right, you guys. I'm gonna go. I'll finish this battle tonight because I'd hate to like leave a game resumed in the background, like, which I always do. But like, what if I don't play Animal Crossing? I can't just close Xenoblade. I can't save. So I'm gonna go though. Thanks for chilling. This one's not an hour long, so hip hip hooray. Um, next time I'll come back, I'll let you know what the B in console B stands for. It's very, it, it eludes me. But for now, I'm going to elude you, so bye. <laughs>